Hi, this is the second part of uh, how to build your uh, own big scale foam glider and I shall tell you about uh, how much uh, materials you, you're gonna need. Uh, the, the plane will be constructed from foam sheets uh, so the next question will be when you made a drawing and the dimensions how much foam do you uh, gonna need. So. Here we got the drawing again, and I just uh, made a, a little instruction how much foam we're gonna need. Here, this is one meter, so this will be one sheet. And I also entered how uh, thick the plate uh, will need to be. So here you can see six centimeters, this one needs to be five centimeters, and the tip also needs to be five centimeters. So the wings are very easy, it's just 5, 5, 6, 6, 5, 5 centimeters. And it's also very easy here, you just measure how thick the wing uh, has to gonna be. Well, it's about 5.6 uh, centimeters, so we just make it a little bit thicker. It's always uh, better because then you get more stiffness, because foam is not that stiff. Uh, for the fuselage, uh, when I measure this part it's 24 centimeters thick so it's better to have a little bit more because normally the foam is a little bit smaller than mentioned on the package and here it's about uh, 17 centimeters so we need two sheets of 6 centimeter and one sheet of 5 centimeter and for the stabilizer we just need one sheet of 5 centimeter of course it will this will be a lot thinner but it's easy to cut it away or saw it uh, away and for the tail we also need uh, a half sheet of uh, 50 centimeters so all these sheets we can uh, uh, add it up and then here at the end you need about 10 sheets of 5 centimeters and 4 sheets of uh, 6 centimeters so that's about 3 packages so then we know how much uh, sheets we need to buy we go to the store and my shop is the Gamma and here you see the, the thickness it's five centimeters and here it's a total thickness well five times five is 25 so that's almost the same uh, like the, the thickness of the fuselage so that's also very nice because you also ever uh, uh, also want an uneven number of sheets because the tail is going to be in the center so this piece will be the nice reference so this part which I drawn will be in the middle at the end because that piece is a little bit thicker and then at the edge it will be smaller so also a nice uh, thing to know uh, when you print out your plane on the on the paper, always make sure the scaling is on in, uh, in your uh, uh, printer because when the scaling is off, I just made an uh, example for here, then it can be smaller or just way thicker. And here it's like it has to be, and I just made it smaller so you can see it can uh, screw up your complete uh, uh, plane when your scaling is not on. So that's an important point to, to look at. So now we got our stuff and uh, we can do the cutting, we have all our foam and then uh, I will uh, see you later on, enjoy!